I sort of come back under a cloud because I felt as I was missing a penalty and uh, whilst the, the tournament went okay for me and it was a great learning and first major tournament, um, I come back under a cloud. The rest of the team, we landed in Luton. There was a quarter of a million people waiting to greet us on the streets of Luton. You know, it took us six hours to get from from the airport to our team hotel where we were going to disperse, which was about six miles away. It was madness. And when you think you're going to, you get on a plane in Italy and you think, I've just been beaten in the semi-final, I just want to go home now. You're feeling sorry for yourself. To see that amount of people to greet you, I mean, it happened nowhere else in the world for a team beaten in a semi-final, I don't think. You know, you can imagine in Germany, if their team come home to a semi-final defeat, there wouldn't be anyone at the airport. They'd probably shut the airport, I'll be honest with you, and tell them to redirect and go elsewhere. But um, it just showed how football grabbed this country and I think it really was, when I look back now, football was in the dark ages I think before 1990 in the World Cup and then from the 1990 tournament sprung the Premier League a couple of years later and I think it, it opened up the door to a lot of people that probably didn't really watch football, they got caught up in it and the excitement of it and England potentially going all the way um, and it was a wonderful tournament to be involved in. but. For me, I come back under a cloud with Chris Waddle, if you like, and missed penalties and feeling sorry for ourselves. But the following season was the best season I ever had as a player because I almost liked the conversation with Brian Clough. I had a point to prove. I had, you know, um, obviously I got dogs abuse at every ground I went to whenever you went, you know, because of the penalty miss. But for me, I had something to prove the following season. It was the best season I ever had. I think I scored 16 goals, no penalties in that. And we got to the FA Cup final with Forest and had a real good season in the league as well. So um, you learn by your, your, your bad times and that certainly was one for me.